hey, don't be afraid of the bar at Five Napkin. What he said. Welcome back to the Five Napkin Burger Beer and Bourbon Blog, featuring us, the Happy Hour Guys, and let's talk left-hand brewing Pole Star Pilsner. A pilsner, or a pils, is a type of pale lager, which takes its name from the town of Pilsen in the Czech Republic where it was first developed. So summer's coming, and what that means is you might want to get into some cleaner, crisper beers. Easy going on the palate, a little bit of hops in there to sort of give you some of that hop snap. And as usual, because we're the happy hour guys, we don't just talk about these places, we take you there. Mark and I were in Longmont, Colorado, where Left Hand is brewed not that long ago. What a great community brewery. And by community, I mean a sense of community that now gets shipped all over the United States. Welcome back to the Happy Hour, guys. We're with Eric Wallace. You are the president, president. the president co -founder. and co-founder of Left Hand Brewing. Thank you very much for taking some time to talk to us. Really appreciate it. Tell us a little bit about why it's Left Hand Brewing. Yeah. Why the name? Brewing. Um, well, we started in 93. We were looking for names, and we were living right down the road in Niwa. It's halfway to Boulder mm -hmm. from here. And Niwa in Arapaho means left hand. And that appeals to me because appearances to the contrary, I'm actually part Native American. So where am I going to pair this up at Five Napkin Burger? I'm thinking lighter beer, lighter meal. How about the peanut chicken salad? That crisp, hoppy finish on the Pilsner is going to cut right through that peanut sauce. Each taste is going to reward the other. Jimmy is absolutely right. The crisp, clean finish of a Pilsner is perfect with lighter fare. Conversely, a lot of people also enjoy Pilsners with spicier dishes. The thinking being that that refreshing Pilsner taste is going to help balance some of the spice in the food. Think of it as a yin and a yang. With that in mind, I'm going to pair this Pilsner with the Southwestern and spicy salmon sushi rolls. And here on the, on the bottle, so this is one of the advantages of the craft beer revolution. You can actually see the day that this beer went into the bottle. This was actually put into the bottle on 12-20-2010, which is just a few months ago now. And it's made its way all the way to the Upper West Side of Manhattan for us to enjoy here at Five Napkin Burgers. So let me help you with that. Look, a hippopotamus. Chicken. Oh, it's really good.